it's easier than ever to create raw, high dynamic range panoramas using the new Merge to HDR Panorama command in Adobe Camera Raw. In this example, I captured three bracketed exposures for each one of the four panels that will be used to create the panorama of the Whalers Bay. I'll select all of the images in Bridge and click to open in Camera Raw. Then, from the Film Strip drop down menu, I'll select All and then Merge to HDR Panorama. Camera Raw automatically applies lens correction profiles and removes chromatic aberration. Then it auto aligns and merges the raw image data from each bracketed exposure and then stitches the merged images to create the panorama. Because not all adjustments made to individual images carry over when selecting the HDR panorama command, I typically wait to apply other adjustments to the resulting panorama. For the projection, I'll select cylindrical, leave the boundary warp to zero because this image has a strong horizon that I don't want to distort. I'll apply the auto tone and color adjustments as well as auto crop, click merge, and then save the file. I'll use the straighten tool in order to straighten the horizon of the image and tap return or enter to apply that. Then I'll move to the presets and apply a preset to get the exact look and feel that I want. So there you go, Camera Raw makes it easier than ever to stitch together HDR panoramas with all of the editing flexibility and superior quality of a RAW file.